flu protocol is coming. It's coming y'all. Let's take a look at some general announcement info. Maybe you don't understand what blue protocol is. Maybe you're curious, maybe you're hype like me. Let's take a look at one of their articles, shall we? Hello, my dears. I am your favorite purple lady, Amethyst Lady, and we are back with another awesome gaming video. Today, we're gonna be discussing Blue Protocol's announcement yesterday at the Game Awards. They made an announcement that they're going to be doing a global launch version of Blue Protocol in 2023. So we're just going to go over an article um, that explains just some general things about the announcement and um, some general information that they want fans and those looking forward to Blue Protocol to know. Before we begin, if you end up liking this video, make sure you click that thumbs up, leave a, a like on the video, it does help. And um, feel free to comment, feel free to comment and subscribe if you're looking for more awesome gaming content, okay? Let's get into the article. Alrighty, so announcing Blue Protocol. This is very exciting. So this is a game that is being developed by Bandai Namco Online and Bandai Namco Studios and is being published by Amazon Games. It is a free to play multiplayer action online RPG. You become the hero of your very own sci-fi fantasy adventure. You explore the world and the world is called Regnus and it's supposed to be an immersive multiplayer experience with deep character customization and action packed combat very exciting these screenshots look absolutely wonderful very pretty i wonder if you can get on top of that see my brain is already <laughs> my brain is already going into like what can i climb on or what can i scale mode when i see these um let's continue you're on a quest to uncover the truth about your origins on your travels you meet people from many worlds and make new friends with whom you share your adventures Eventually, you'll find yourself facing an inescapable destiny that will determine the fate of planet Regnus. The overuse of technology has created a distortion of space-time, which will eventually engulf planet Regnus and cause its destruction. To change that fate, you and your friends must travel to an unknown world in search of the truth and a solution. That is really cool. We can learn more about the world of Regnus on the world page and get a glimpse into the immersive adventure experience on the story page. So that's cool. Um, the website does have a wealth of information, y'all. We're just going over this article in this video, but um, you know, we're we're gonna keep looking at Blue Protocol, um, keep covering some things. So stay tuned. All right, so action packed combat. It doesn't matter if you're a beginner or an advanced player, the action-based combat system features controls that are customizable and able to match any play style. I hope there is good controller support. That is one thing that I always look for. Um, let's continue. Your class is dependent on the weapons you choose, allowing you to adapt to challenges without changing your character. That's nice. Okay. Switch between, um, switch between five different classes, each with unique skills that add damage multipliers, healing and elemental effects that can be modified and leveled up. That's cool as well. Equip combinations of skill modifiers and summon echoes. Mystical creatures derived from the planet's power that bolster your abilities or aid you in battle. Hmm, okay. So they're like summon, Create a custom hero fit for your playstyle. That's cool. All right. So you can learn about the classes like the dual axe wielding twin striker and the element manipulating spell weaver in the classes section of the gameplay page. So once again, we're not going to go over that in this video. We're just going over this article, but um, stressing there's a wealth of information on this website. All right. Deep customization. There's good diversity here, so that is always nice to see. Your character is an integral part of Blue Protocol. Enhance your adventure 
by enjoying complete character and combat customization. Control how your character appears with custom facial features, hairstyles, outfits, accessories, and express their personality with gestures and dances. Okay. Create a true to you character representative in the game. Now I'm going to test this because you know, I like my characters with some melanin. So we're going to test this thoroughly. I can't wait for the character creator to come out. Um, if it comes out standalone, it might not, but I do know there will be a beta. So we'll see. We're going to test this. Explore the vast world with a variety of mounts and craft custom weapons and gear for a truly unique experience. Okay. So I'm curious about the crafting system. Um, and mounts are cool. I hope they have some cool looking mounts. Um, as for the multiplayer side of things. Okay. Okay. Once again, this looks great. Work together as a team with other players to tackle quests, fight boss battles, and engage in massive online raids against towering monsters. All up my alley. Sounds great. There are three options when entering any dungeon, raid, or mission. Solo, matchmaking, and recruiting parties. Very nice. Solo lets players go it alone. Matchmaking randomly connects you with available players on a similar level. Recruiting parties lets you browse browse the parties who are taking on the same challenge. If you choose to go solo, don't neglect giving aid to someone in the same area to get bonus rewards. Um, if you decide to make more formal arrangements, you can expect additional damage and add bonuses such as HP region. Okay. In addition, players and parties pull some items that enemies drop, making it easier to compete to complete certain quests and adventure board challenges. So they give you like a little, it sounds like they give you a little bit. If you decide to go solo, like you're not entirely penalized for just wanting to play by yourself. Um, as long as you, you know, don't neglect helping someone else in the same area, you get some bonus rewards. But if you decide to go in with an arranged group, that's also going to give you some benefits. Um, additional damage and some bonuses. So that's, that's cool. That's cool. Um, have a group or find others. You don't know. Wait, have a group or find others. You want to play with consistently join a team. Teams are like gills with a roster of like-minded players who can easily find each other and play together. Okay. So teams have leaders, deputies, and assistants who help administrate the team and can rank up. All right. So that's cool too. Um, I'm wondering what the benefits are of belonging to a team. I know that I've ran some teams, crews, alliance guilds before. Um, I wouldn't mind leading one if people are interested for this game at least. Um, but you know, we'll see. So if you are interested, and running with some people because I'm I'm usually of the mind that I like to be really strong and be able to run things um, and be able to do hard content and all that. So if that is your um, your bag, too, then leave a comment below or just let me know how you like to play, you know, your MMOs. Um, I'm interested in, you know, who's stopping by and what type of players you are. So feel free to introduce yourself, but okay. So the end just says stay informed. There's a lot of information that you can get through the website once again. So let me know what you think in the comments. I'm not going to drag this video out. Really appreciate everyone watching this video. Thank you very much. Like comment, subscribe, and look out for more awesome gaming content. Awesome blue protocol content. Okay. Take care my dears. Until next time, bye.